I don't know why, but I was sitting eating breakfast. I was having a burrito and I got on Twitter and I was just like scrolling down through all my tweets like in the past and I caught myself laughing, wondering, questioning um, just my past tweets. Um, I think I had Twitter at way too young of an age. So I thought it would be so funny to film a video just of me going like all the way back, just like scanning, scanning, scanning all the way down to like old tweets and just reacting to them. Like I love watching those videos, like people reacting to this and stuff. It gets super funny. So that's just what we're gonna do. Um, if you wanna be entertained, stay on. I'm on my Twitter, follow me. It's Presley Love, PSS, whatever. Um, I'm just gonna scroll. I'm just gonna like, I didn't look at all of them because I stopped myself and I was like, I need to like actually film a video of me reacting to these. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna start literally in 2015. So this is what, like four years ago? Not even that old. Okay, I made a tweet in June. Literally just ate in the nicest water burger ever. Wow, Presley, it, it got one like. I bet people were really excited for you. Okay, yeah, I think we were on a trip. When it rains in Nashville, my life's complete. Wow, also June, 2015. I'm just gonna keep going. I just, I don't know, I was such a weird kid. I still am. Milkshakes are my comfort thing. Nice. June, 2014, recording my favorite song. D. Wonder what I was recording when I used to really be a songwriter. Waiting in the airport. Come on and hurry up. Oh my God, and those emojis I put. Okay, let's see. Pretty sure I saw at John Luke riding a bike in Seaside or his double. Huh. Yeah, I like used to have the biggest crush on John Luke from Dynasty and I swore I saw him, but how, why did I tweet that? I need to go way more back. One, two, three, four. Get to see Catching Fire again. Oh my God, I was obsessed with The Hunger Games. Like literally, literally that show or that series, whatever, was my crap. I was at every midnight premiere. Popcorn chicken after school is one word. Amazing. I love snacks after school. Um, about to get on a helicopter. Fiddlesticks, memories. Some things are too funny. They really are, Presley. They really are. Radioactive with a black square. Deep. I always like really thought, you know, adding that one emoji beside a word or like a quote, you know, just that really different cool emoji really is gonna add something. Oh! Uh, <laughs> I just didn't know. I still don't know. So, little backstory. I just didn't really ever like listen to like nasty things. I'm not trying to sound like a saint, but like when my when people around me were being inappropriate or whatever, I always just like shut off my ears because like I don't care. It's nasty. I don't care. Um, I made this tweet in 2013 and I put, oh my, I remember my best friend McKenna telling me I should probably take that down because in the future, oh my God. I put cold, comma, wet days. Okay, mind you, I I swear, I had no clue like what I was saying. It was raining outside, I literally remember that. Because above it, I put seriously, this weather is amazing. Okay, okay, we're moving on, we're moving on. My toes are froze. Wow, no likes on that. Love wearing silky socks, It's re it really is comfy. Oh my God. Okay, I'm scrolling down farther. Them blue eyes. At Jory, my friend Jory, what the heck? Then blue eyes, wow, when you are Texas country. Oh, then I I tweeted an emoji of a, what what's that called, a magic ball? Can you see it? Really into emojis, as you can tell. Caramel apple with nuts. I, I, I'm so inappropriate on here and I didn't even realize it. Oh my God, when I was, this is what I say when I was too young to be on Twitter. The star test is already stressing me out. Why do the people in Austin do this to kids? I mean, I still agree with it, but like, why did I go to Twitter to tweet that? That's just saying I'm 12. That dynasty is cracking me up. 
2013. Oh my God. I'm telling you, like I was a Duck Dynasty fan. Like I really went through a phase of like being committed to that show. Probably because John Luke. Oh, backstory, because I just, I saw, a uh, I retweeted a tweet from Justin Bieber. So when I first got Twitter, again, I was too young, had no clue what I was doing. Um, you know, I started like following people. I don't even know. I was so dumb. But like, so I followed Justin Bieber, of course, because, you know, I was going to marry him at the time. And it, so it came up on notifications like, I think it said like following Justin Bieber. Did my stomach just crawled. I haven't ate like all day. Came up like following Justin Bieber, like you're following. And I literally like sat there, I remember for like 10 minutes and I was like, did literally Justin Bieber just follow me? Like I couldn't get over, I really thought he followed me and then I was like, okay, Presley, nope, nope, gotta, no, that's not what happened. Getting all gleamed up, okay. Not using glam, but I guess it was gleam at the time, Press. What, where was I going at 10.56 a.m. Getting all gleamed up. I love the song Radioactive, period. Again, the, cap, the love was capitalized. Just wrote a great song with at Brandon Ray Music and at Cabo Rabo today. Can't wait for everyone to hear it. Hashtag Nashville, hashtag Music Row. So yeah, actually, yeah, 2013, when I again was a songwriter, um, I wrote a song with Brandon Ray. He's a country singer and then, uh, I co-wrote it with him and my uncle Rob. He's like a producer in Nashville and it was like actually such a fun time and I still have the song. Um, I still have the song on my phone. It's like super, it's him, it's Brandon Ray singing it and playing it on the guitar, but like we all wrote it together and it was like a big idea that, of mine because maybe I should put it on here one day. I always felt like this song should g get out and be famous. It's like super good. Yeah, tweet me if you wanna hear this song. Okay, so anyway. My Oh my god, I retweeted so much stuff. Put shaving cream and chalk on cars. I mean, really? It damages them. People are so smart nowadays. Dot, dot, dot. Wow. I was really giving people my two cents then and now. I mean, that is dangerous. Beautiful Creatures is the best movie ever. Dot. Hashtag Beautiful Creatures. Actually, I would, I would retweet this today. It seriously is like such an underrated movie. It's like... When I watched it in 2013, I instantly fell in love with it. I bought it on disc. I watched it like probably 20 times. Um, it's such a freaking good movie. And I was so mad when they didn't make the next one because it's a book series. It's whatever floats your boat. Wow. Okay, that's deep, Presley. Whichever way the cookie crumbles. Cookie emoji. Like, what was I trying to be Buddha? Like, I guess I'd been on Pinterest, you know, looking up wise quotes. Great day at tennis today. I love tennis. I miss Full House episodes. I don't even really remember like being a fan fan. Like I watched Full House, but I don't really remember like watching it that much. I guess at the time I just missed it. I don't. Smile today. 13 was a year. That was a year. It's hot outside. Wow. Oh my God. None of these had likes. Another commercial break, dot, dot, dot. Hashtag catching fire trailer. Please hurry. I literally remember like getting ready for this trailer. I was so excited. So ready to watch the catching fire teaser trailer because some movie award thing was doing it. That's the way the cookie crumbles. Okay, I already tweeted about a cookie crumbling. My mom and sister are taking forever. We were probably shopping. Oh, I'm snapshotting all these so I can put them on here so it'll be real professional. 400 tweet right here. Hashtag tweet. Oh my God. My mom just made the best dinner ever. It's probably spaghetti. That's like my favorite food of all time. Chilling and eating a green apple laugh. Apple laffy. Apple laffy. Apple laffy taffy. It's apple, ta it's just apple taffy. Another emoji. I hate, I hate the tongue sticking out. Don't do it people. Let's end this era of sticking your tongue out. Well, oh, this is too, TMI, TMI. I should not have ate a cherry pie, cookie, and cinnamon done. Bun. Does not sell well with my stomach. Hashtag fact. Deep. You know what? I need to just start tweeting like this again on a normal basis, you know? Oh my god, I'm so wise! Be happy with the things you have. Ha dot dot dot. A lot of people don't even have a phone. Hashtag enough. Hashtag said. True though. Missing my vampire diaries, but when I get home, it will be the first thing I do. Hashtag TBD party. Then a little hashtag that didn't have anything by it. 
love chicken express hashtag i really do what the heck like i have to like enunciate how much i do it with the hashtag oh my god oh my god i put 2013 once again you're a celebrity deal with it or get off instagram Ooh, presley was getting ghetto what celebrities are so annoying when they put Quotations, please don't put LB on all my photos or trying to advertise yourself on my Instagram. Which, yeah, I feel like that's super annoying to them, but I'm like, okay, sick, but getting better. I had to let y'all know. 2012. I was so scared that year, I thought the world was gonna end. I didn't think it, but like everybody was telling me it was, and it, like that stuff freaks me out. So that was like a really eventful year for me. I was trying to just, you know, be like, shut up. Oh my God. Every revolution begins with a spark. Hashtag catching fire. Hashtag the spark. Hashtag excited. I'm just going to end the video here. It was just a little chill, fun, dumb video. Um, I just, I love like looking back at like my past self and being like, wow. <laughs> like I'm so smart. I'm so funny. I should do one on Facebook. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye.